Hello everyone and welcome back to my art channel. This week I am continuing the story of Nettle and the Hushers and her first meeting with her future companion, Kat. Um, as you know, the last times I've done it, there's two other videos. Um, there's only been um, just one or two panels. Uh, but for some reason this Monday I started sketching the next panel and it just turned out to be like six more comic pages because I don't know if you know this um, if you follow me on social media you might know but I really truly really enjoy comic books um, especially European comic books um, I do like the style a lot better or in the in the comics um, and I really like to draw them as well um, I've never actually had a comic like web comic that's been going on for a while but I've been wanting to do it, it's just that it's hard for me to commit to something like that. Um, but anyway, uh, this is only six pages and I really want to complete it, so I hope you guys are ready for some comics, I, I guess. Um, as you can see, it's pretty simple. Um, it's just, well, simple, simple. A little bit more action, I would say, than the last few panels that you've seen. This panel... Um, well, this comic page, I must say. Um, uh, Nettle is getting fed up uh, that Cat is really following her and annoying her, and she's scared. Like she's scared, and that's that that um, that like what do you call it? That feeling of being scared just turns into like an anger. Like just go away, just. Just go away. So that's what she says. She screams at the cat and says, Go away! Um, and of course, cat is just so like amazed and scared and just like, What? I didn't do anything. I was just following you. Um, of course, Nettle feels a little bad because cat didn't do anything wrong. He was just following her. And she, she turns around and leaves. Um, I do have another six well, five pages so you'll see the horse story um of the first meeting um yeah i'm not sure how to share it though um i've been thinking about just uploading it to twitter and instagram and facebook but somehow it feels wrong i don't know what it is i um i i feel like it won't get that much attention if I just post it there. So I was thinking about posting it on Tapastic, even though it's only going to be a very short series. Um, if people really like it, I might continue to do it. Um, I think it. I would. I really enjoy Nettle and the Hushers, and I do have a lot of stories that could go with it. And it's really nice because when I sketched out these six pages. It just felt natural, you know, when you know the characters and you know what they would do in this situation and what would happen next. That's that's the natural feel when you draw comics. When that happens, you just feel great, and and that's what I really love when I draw comics is is that the characters just do what they want to do. I just I'm just drawing what they want to do. <laughs> it's really really fun. Um, I also was thinking when I was doing this that. If you guys want to know how I create comic pages, like how I put out the layouts, like the rhythm, like for me it's very important that when you look through the page and your eyes kind of follow from left to right and downwards, it has a rhythm, um, it feels nice to look at, and that's very important to me. And I have some tips and tricks on how to do that. Um, I know it's kind of like not everyone want to know how to do comics, but if you do want to know, uh, please tell me. And I, because I, I really love doing this. Uh, <laughs> it's my passion. <laughs> please let me do it. Anyway, um, I have been also thinking that I do want to do um, some tutorials because I've been saying that I will do tutorials, but I haven't done it yet. And I will sit down and do a very simple one. Um, Probably how to draw certain parts of the face or expressions just because I have to start small before I go up to the big ones uh, and I have to figure out a way to teach that is easy and fun and simple and understandable so I hope you guys appreciate that <laughs> um, I'll try to do this weekend um, no promises though I will try um, anyhow uh, other things to talk about uh, I feel like my videos are just getting kind of rambly. 
I'm deleting like less and less of what I'm saying the first time, which might be a bad thing or might be a good thing. I am not sure. My biggest thing, <laughs> I'm not sure. Anyway, things to talk about. I found a brush that I really like. Um, as I said in the previous video with Nettle and the Hush Hush, I tried this other brush and I didn't like it. It didn't feel right. Um, I do like when brushes have kind of like a pencil texture to it. Um, and I ended up downloading, because every artist is using Kyle's brushes at the moment. And I ended up downloading his big pack and especially the pencil like the, the pencil like part of that set um, I found and I just scaled it up and I love it like it works so well with doing this comic so uh, I, I must say oh it, it just it, it's just sometimes you have this brush and then suddenly everything goes really quickly because you love it and it just works that's what happened. So I'm really happy that <laughs> that happened. Uh, so if you want like really good brushes for line art, try Kyle's brushes. They are not they're not very pricey when you think about there's someone that actually created these. Um, but I do recommend them because um, there is a lot of really cool brushes in those sets. Um, some of them are also free, so you can try some of them. Or they're not free. They're like uh, pay what you think it's worth. Um, I would recommend you to pay at least like one dollar, one pound, um, just because this is someone's work. It's it's not just free. Um, so try that. Um, just a little bit of recommendation for this week. Uh, anyhow, yeah, back to the comic. Uh, I will probably do another comic for next week. I'm sorry, like, I'm not sure if you guys actually want to see, like, the behind the scenes of the comics. Please tell me if you think that drawing comics on this channel is a bit of a waste. That you want to see more illustration work, like, single panels, because I can do that as well. Uh, or illustrations, or more of um, the random concept art, or, like, random designing uh, characters and stuff, because I do want to do that more. Um, if you do want to see what you want to see, what you think this channel is about, because um, I really love comics and I really want to do that, but I'm not sure what you guys actually want to see, so um, I thought it would be a good idea to ask. So please tell me if what I'm doing is not something that you like, uh, because I can change it. No, wait, what, what am I saying? Um, if I ever annoy you with any of the stuff that I do, please tell me. Um, I will do stuff that I love. Uh, I won't say anything against that. Sorry guys, I will do what I love. <laughs> Comics I do love. I will start, like continue recording it, but if you do want to see it or not, please tell me. Um, anyway, I think it's, it's quite um, interesting because it kind of includes... It's like an illustration, there's like full story there. They just told the story instead of just one picture. Anyway, I don't know. I'm, I, I just keep babbling. I'm sorry. Uh, rambling through these videos. Um, I'm rambling for 10 minutes. That's what I'm doing. Um, anyway, uh, <laughs> back to what I'm doing. Uh, I'm just putting in text. Um, that was kind of messy. So I kind of like some of the things that you see, I've actually changed later um, that I didn't record. So be aware of that. Um, so I'll put the final piece at the end, at the end, and I'll also upload the final piece um, on the website, most likely, well, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, definitely. Possibly I'll do Papastic, but I feel like I need a cover and a first, first page before I do that. Um, Anyway guys, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this week's video and um, you have a great weekend and do a lot of art, do what you love, draw comics if you're inspired by my video, draw comics and I will see you guys next Friday. Bye bye!